Hi, my name is Drew Bauer, and I'm a sophomore with City Impact. And this piece is called Terminal Illness. From the second we are born to the second before we die, we are dying. Some of us die quick and painless. Others die in a slow, more painful way. But I am destined to die in the slowest, most painful way possible. Did you know that among just our first chromosome, there are roughly 180 million possible genetic disorders? Simply one little mutation on one little allele of one little gene can be the start to a terminal illness that can end your movie early. You see, there's a smudge on the film of my DNA reel that's causing my director to want to say cut. A catastrophic carcinomic cardiologic crisis simply put my problem is the proliferation to a perpetual parapetia. The tumor that was in my heart from birth recently metastasized. Cut! A simple biopsy, really, confirmed the presence. The first thought was to remove it surgically. But as dad held my hand, he told me the culprit was pervasive, already rooted deeply throughout my body. Fear gripped my heart as tight as my father's embrace. Dad is always the first person I run to for grace. Tears turned into a deluge of denial, people constantly asking, how are you? Sometimes it's easier to just smile. They don't really want to know the truth. Did I forget to mention the bonus side effect? A form of blindness that blurs my vision. I tried to fix it with rose-colored glasses, but as you all know, Band-Aids don't fix bullet holes. They're no help. They're just for show. I tried to ignore it. I tried to embrace it. Oblivious or roguish, I still couldn't see. In the darkness, my heart is overwhelmed by confusion. The cure for this hereditary disease is a blood transfusion. It's expensive. The procedure costs approximately more than this whole world could even afford, and the life of the donor. Transfusion begins the transformation, but healing requires much more. With the new blood, the old heart must go. And without a doubt, these scars will show. As I feel his heart beat inside of me, and I feel his love rush through my veins, all I can think is, thanks, Dad. <laughs>